What is up, everybody? This is Jay Wilkins 79. Welcome back to my short movie review show. Today, right now, I'm doing Ishtar. Now, I rented, not rented, sorry. I bought this VHS copy because I didn't want to spend the money to either rent the DVD or buy the DVD. So I just bought the VHS. And I noticed when I got this, the box is upside down. They got the movie coming out this way at the top when it should be down here but that's all right I'm just nitpicking I drew this movie out of a hat on my I don't want to watch this movie series where I take movies and draw one out of a hat I have to watch after view it most of them are bad movies that I do not want to see so this one yes I was expecting this to be horrible I did some research on it I watched some YouTube clips this movie probably gets the most hate out of any movie ever made. This stars Dustin Hoffman, Warren Beatty, Charles Grodin. I forget the girl's name. I'm going to cheat here because I got it pulled up on IMDb. Uh, her name is Isabel Adjani. Jeannie. So let's get right into the movie. Sunglasses Man watched it with me too, by the way. It's not bad. It does not deserve the hate. They're songwriters. I like how they come up with these funny songs. And people say, well, the music is horrible. The music, the songs are horrible. That's the point. The music is supposed to be horrible. What did you think? So that's a, a main reason why this movie does not deserve the hate it gets. Because the songs are supposed to be bad, okay? So I think that's funny that they do these funny songs. They... They, but they're really try to be serious musicians, and they're really not. But they're they write songs better than most people could. Dustin Hoffman is okay, you know. Um, Warren Beatty, I think, steals the show. I think he's funnier, even though Dustin Hoffman is is okay in it. And Dustin Hoffman as an actor is a great person. I, I'm not gonna say what's going on in his what they're finding out now about him, but I've always respected Dustin Hoffman as an actor. I think he's one of the greatest actors that ever lived. Also, Warren Beatty is one of the greatest actors that have ever lived. So this movie, Ishtar, I'm going to give it three out of five stars. It was not bad. I did not mind watching it. Out of the movies I usually pick on my I don't want to watch this show, this was probably the best one out of them. And I like Charles Grodin, too. Jack Weston was also in it. He played the agent trying to get them gigs, and he just sends them to Ishtar because he doesn't really care about them. But at, in the end, they finally do get to play a show in a big setting. So, uh, uh, Sunglasses Man, what did you think, buddy? Um, I was asleep the whole movie, Jay Wilkins. I was crashing off my seven energy drinks, man. What is this? Ishtar? Ishtar. Ishtar. Ish, ish, no, Ishtar. 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 Right? Ishtar? Uh, ish, Ishtar. Warren Beatty. Beatty? Warren, Be Warren Beatty. Warren Beatty. Dustin Hoffman. Ho Hoffman. 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 I don't know. Sunglasses, man, you're not helping. So anyway, I give Ishtar three out of five stars. Does not deserve the hate it gets. It's a pretty thoroughly in in enjoying, enjoyable, is what I meant to say, movie. Right here, Ishtar. You know, come on, give it a chance. That's all I'm saying. I could bump it up to three and a half stars, but I'm going to stick with the three out of five. This has been Jay Wilkins 79. Please subscribe if you have not yet. Please give this video a thumbs up for me. It really helps me out. And that's about it, guys. I love movies, and movies are my life. So this is me. Go get another energy drink, dude. Go ahead.